Three shootings took place in the course of eight days along Ocean Boulevard in Myrtle Beach, the most recent incident during Memorial Day weekend. As News 19's Jenna Krasina reports, tourism leaders are concerned about the recent violence. I think you always have to take uh, safety in mind when you're traveling, regardless of where the location is. On Sunday, May 17th, Myrtle Beach law enforcement responded to a shooting near Ocean Boulevard that left two injured. Less than a week later, during Memorial Day weekend, two more shootings took place in the same area on back-to-back -back days. Multiple people were injured and one died. The City of Myrtle Beach spokesperson, Mark Krua says those shootings do not reflect the overall atmosphere of the Grand Strand. Absent that, we had a wonderful couple of weekends here at Myrtle Beach. They granted, everybody's getting back up to speed. Restaurants are still limited in their capacity based on the governor's order. But uh, Myrtle Beach really had a, a spectacular weekend last weekend. The Myrtle Beach Area Chamber of Commerce issued a statement after the shooting. It reads in part, The safety and well-being of our visitors and residents is always our priority. Myrtle Beach was founded as a vacation destination for families, and we are going to do everything we can as a chamber to support our city and our law enforcement to ensure we remain a family destination. Meanwhile, Krua says safety is a priority down at the coast. Over the last three years, we've added 30 police officers. We've um, increased our technology. We are working to retain and, and promote our police department. Our crime rate has fallen about 19% in the last couple of years. So we've made tremendous progress. Um, Ocean Boulevard, the downtown Myrtle Beach area, is safer than it has been in 20, 25 years. Over the holiday weekend, Krua says despite the pandemic, he estimates that they had anywhere between 200 to 300,000 visitors. Great family crowd in town this past weekend. The beach was busy. People were practicing social distancing as they should. We were a very popular destination this weekend. Jenna Kurzina, News 19 WLTX. Myrtle Beach leaders say they're gearing up for what is expected to be a busy summer since most spring events were rescheduled in the next few months. Stay with us.